people. Well, they, they can do a lot. Unfortunately, what is unfortunate about the whole, you know, they've not had enough time. You know, they just came and I think we played yeah, Brazil. You know, match you know, now we have another friendly match yeah, coming. Against Switzerland. Yeah, which I believe definitely there will be an improvement, you know. But I, I think we should not panic. We've been to the World Cup three times. Three times. This is our fourth time we're going. We've played teams that we've played before. We're going to play meet teams that we've played before. We shouldn't panic. Yeah, I don't. I don't see. Uh, yes, if you lose to Brazil, yes, maybe three zero was maybe a bit of on the high. But it's Brazil. You know something. And you won against Nicaragua, not too uh, convincing. Convincing, perhaps. but we won. You know something. It's positive. Let's speak on the positives. And 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 from now onwards, I think the idea of criticizing, saying this, thing, no. Otoado is our coach now. He's got. This is Draman. He's got uh, George Boateng, George Boateng Chris, Chris Hughes. These guys are not, they know about the game. They understand the game. Chris, Chris is a huge guy. Yeah. You know, Premier and all that. New so, so, Brighton, so definitely, definitely you know, they, they will support him. Yeah. Norwich. And exactly. All. You know, uh, Boateng, I, I, I was supposed to have worked with him when I was the head. So I had a chance of meeting him too. Oh, okay. Talk to him. Okay. I met also in that same moment, I met Chris. Spoke to him. Oh, okay. When you talk to them, you can clearly see. You're on the field, on the field already. They know, they know what, what the game is about. They will help Otoado and who will do well. You know, but I think onwards, onwards, on, from now onwards, we need to be positive. We need to be positive. Even what, whatever we've seen that is negative, don't hammer it too much, too much on it. Let's be positive and let's go into this World Cup. And I'm, I believe we can, we can come out. How should we approach the game against Uruguay? I remember you were doing commentary in the 23rd World Cup. Yeah. I should have asked you that question. <laughs> <laughs> because I, I hear you collapse. <laughs> no, during the, the penalty. Yes. Yeah, against Europe, yes. I, I was sure. That so we the I didn't collapse. I, I, I was like, oh. And my seat went, went, went I back. I went yeah. back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was shocked, you know. Yeah, but, you know. I, I think, uh, uh, I made mention of yeah. the, the big guys. Yeah. They will know exactly what to do. I'm not in a position to... Say they should. But do, they if should you do were do. in opposition, I'm not. So I can, I can, I can, <laughs> I can say any, anything. But I, I strongly believe that they will, they will come out good. Portugal, Uruguay, South Korea, we can qualify beyond the group. Yes, we can qualify if we do the right things. Come again. If we do the right things. Yes, if we do the right thing. We will do the right thing. And what are the right things? The technical <laughs> men will, will, will know. <laughs> <laughs> so if you take a look at the Black Stars, how far do you think we can, we can do in this time? Well, you see, we need to look at it from the group stages. Yes. Then when you, when you qualify to a group, then you look at the next opponent, you yes. see the opponent. And most of the time, these are things the technical men will, will do. We'll look at the videos, data, what, you know, their strength, their weaknesses and all that. And you, you apply it, educate the guys, or bring it on board what exactly you want from the because once you see how they play, you will have an idea of how to approach the game and how you want to want to win. And then they will, they will, they will do it. Okay.